Deceit is at the heart of Freemasonry, according to the greatest Freemason of all time, Albert Pike. In fact, in Morals and Dogma, Pike writes that in the Blue Degrees, the initiate is intentionally misled. Something more than deception binds the initiate when he takes the blood oaths. Oswald Wirth, a well-known 33rd degree French Grand Lodge Mason, confirms in his book, The Ideal Initiate, 1927, that the act of taking the Masonic Oath is in fact selling one's soul to the devil. And I quote, It is a serious matter to ask for initiation, for one has to sign a pact which demands that the man's soul be truly committed in the act. It is not, then, like driving a bargain with the devil in which the evil one allows himself to be tricked. It is an agreement entered into seriously on both the devil and the initiate's sides, and there is no escape from its clauses. The initiate himself is by that very fact indissolubly bound to his masters. It would all be nothing if you could ask to be initiated free of all obligation without paying with your very soul, end quote. 